Animating a 3D object in a 2D photo is actually simpler than you think. Let's start. First I will add a photo as the camera background. The photo is the camera background, not an object. In fact, the image is only displayed in the viewport, but when rendered, it has not appeared yet. Now we will make the image appear at render time. Configure the same for rendering in the viewport as it is for rendering. Now you can render images. The next thing is to create a terrain that closely resembles the terrain in the photo. I will use the inner edge of the pavement as a reference since it is quite straight. You adjust the angle of view of the camera so that the X or Y axis coincides with this line. It also needs to be adjusted so that the axis remains so that the XY plane appears to coincide with the surface of the road. I created a plane and placed it on the pavement. Use the extrude commands to create the curves and slopes of the lawn. We determine where to place the 3D object and just create the terrain for that part. Now it's time to turn this plane into a shadow catcher, i.e. it only shows the shadow of another object but not itself. This feature is only available in Cycles Rendering. Now I create an object and you see the sphere leaving a shadow on the pavement. My job is to adjust the light source so that the shadow of the sphere looks like the other shadows in the photo. You see the shadow created by the sun it's too sharp, not like in the picture. So I changed the sun to area and pulled it away in the direction of the light. I increased the size of the light source so that its shadow was blurred. Scattered light of the environment is always present in reality. In short, we will create conditions that are closest to reality in the photo. Now I create a moving ball like the trailer you guys saw at the beginning of the video. To adjust the direction of the ball rolling, you will change the direction of gravity.
done. You see it's pretty simple, right? Thank you for watching the video, hope it is useful to you. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Love you all. Goodbye.